Hey guys, Mike Majors here with another tutorial for you using Photoshop CS6. Today we'll be looking at a tutorial on how to remove unwanted background from any upfront image. This tutorial is just for people who have an image but they don't like the background so they want to remove the background. Uh, this is the technique you use using Photoshop CS6. Okay, let's get into it. Open Photoshop, go to File, create a new project, uh, name it whatever you want. Uh, I'll be naming, me, naming it Wine Bottle, because that's the image that I'm going to be using. Uh, my, my width pixels are 1080 by 820. So I'm leaving all the other uh, resolution and color mode is there, and the bare background contents, I'm going to leave it a transparent for this tutorial. So clicking OK. So there's our canvas right there. So now I'm going to go to the image. I'm clicking open on the file and going straight to my image. So I'm looking for my wine bottle. So here it is. I'm going to click select it and click open. <clears throat> and it's going to pop up. Okay. As you can see, the wine bottle is here in which that's the image that I want. Uh, but I don't want the background. So I'm uh, interested only in this one bottle and I want to eliminate the background here. So this is how I'm going to do it. So I'm using the pen tool. You can select or outline outline the image very carefully. Just to make sure you select right around your image. Um, if it's too small, you can use the zoom tool. and zoom it in so that you get a clear view of the edges so you can make an accurate selection. Uh, just for tutorial sake, I am not going to be really accurate on this one, but just to get the idea across on how to remove the background, uh, this is just a tutorial to get the idea across. So um, I've made now made a selection all around this uh, image that I've selected. This image that I want so I want to eliminate the background so what I'm going to do is within the image I'm going to right click and select make selection and then I'm going to leave the radius at 12 pixels click OK and you will see <coughs> sorry about that uh, you will see that now the image we have marked with our pen tool has been uh, selected officially um, so from here it's very easy you go to the layers panel and then you see this icon down here like a camera icon but it's actually a mask icon so it says add mask uh, we're going to click it and in a moment and uh, what it does is it automatically removes the background from your selected image so what we have selected in here will remain and this one will go so that's how you do it so we can just click that and we'll see the magic in that and there you go you see that every image and every back background image has just vanished and now we only have the image that we have selected so and if you uh, would like to refine the mask you just go to your refiners layer there and you right click and come down to refine mask just to get the edges correct and then you fiddle around with these settings here just to get something to your taste. So I'm going to leave it like this and I'm going to click OK and there you go. So now you have the wine bottle all by itself away from the background and you can manipulate it using the transform controls and zoom it up or in or out uh, to your liking and use it wherever you want. So thanks for watching this tutorial and if you like this video you can subscribe and click the like button below uh, thank you, I'm Mike Majors, over and out.